Okay, she's very sad and in a, in a blizzard and has no climbing gear. Um, I think you could also die while rock climbing. Um, I'm not so sure it would be good if she fell from this height. No, Carla, don't fall from there. Hi, this is Charity and welcome back to the Super Sim Challenge, a challenge in The Sims 4 where we try to get all of the aspirations, milestones, careers, degrees, and everything we can possibly do with a single sim. Now Carla is working on her teenager aspirations, but it's Sunday and I'm kind of stuck on all of them. So I decided to go to Mount Kumurabi and try the extreme sports enthusiast. And the reason why I want to do this one is because you have to get injured and you can only get injured if you have low skill. So I don't want her to be very fit. I don't want her to have any athletic skill whatsoever. And we're gonna try to do this aspiration first. All right, first we have to go down the bunny slope and I have to figure out where that is. Okay, here's the bunny slope. It's not the main slide. Okay, I almost did this one on the easy slope, but no, they mean this one. So we'll just do it one time. Hopefully she doesn't get that much skill, but um, she's very confident, so she probably will. Okay, I got some loner skis, but I didn't go skiing. We'll try the info board first. Okay, current condition is fair. Um, this one looks a little bit more intense than the other ones, but she's doing pretty well. Oh, she fell. Okay, that counted, and she only has level two of the skiing skill. Good. I'm not sure what vending machine has the remedies or deterrents, but we'll check the one in the onsen. Okay, bits and baubles. Okay, I guess they mean these things. We'll just buy a couple of them. And that was pretty easy. Okay, now we need to achieve level three rock climbing skill, complete a hiking trail, actively ski, snowboard, or rock climb for three hours, and encounter a Komodara or forest spirit. I'm guessing that I want to save the rock climbing skill for, for the injury uh, or the skiing one. Um, so skiing, I'm already level two. Maybe we should try to get injured snowboarding or rock climbing and just go ahead and max out skiing. Okay, we'll try hiking to the historic shrine. I'm not sure if we will encounter a spirit or not. Okay, she kind of looped around there. That didn't make any sense. <laughs> Carla actually injured herself on the ski slope. And I bet I won't be able to do that again. Luckily, this is not increasing my fitness. Okay, I did not see a forest spirit anywhere. Okay, no, Carla, don't just go back. I want you to hike back just in case we can encounter the spirits again. Oh, she found one. That was easy. No, 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 no. Let's make a wish. Where are you going, Carla? Why are you running away from them? Oh, well, at least I got credit for it. Come on, make a wish. Where are you going? I think it's because I canceled the hike. Maybe I wasn't supposed to cancel it. Maybe I just was supposed to make a wish. Yeah, she had to go all the way back down and come all the way back up. Don't cancel the hiking interaction. Wow, she got 50 simoleons. All right, it is now 1.23 p.m. and we're trying the small climbing wall. Um, I don't know. Oh, we acquired the fitness skill. That's bad. And of course, it's a blizzard. Okay, it's, I got credit for... Okay, no, I have level one rock climbing skill. I thought I had an hour, but no. This is not giving me any skill. Okay, I have halfway of level one completed. Hopefully I don't get to level three during this. Now my fitness is level two. And good, that was my three hours. So now I just need rock climbing level three and then we need to hurt ourselves. Okay, level three. <laughs> Let's see if we can go on something that's a little bit more difficult to hopefully get injured. 
Okay, she's very sad and in a, in a blizzard and has no climbing gear. Um, I think you can also die while rock climbing, so maybe we should bring someone here with, that has a death flower. Here we go, we attempt the climb. Um, I'm not so sure it would be good if she fell from this height. Oh, she actually made it to the top. The only problem with rock climbing is it also gives you fitness skill. I'm not sure if skiing and snowboarding give you fitness skill, but I think the fitness skill will keep you from getting injured if it's too high. This is why I wanted to try this first. Great. She keeps making it. Yeah, here's how you can cheat with rock climbing. Just have a ghost go up to the top. They don't even need to rock climb. No, Carla, don't fall from there. You need to fall at the bottom. I wonder if it counts if you die from rock climbing. Probably not. And she's level four. Oh, I fell. Good. I fell from a relatively high height, but not all the way up the wall. So that's done. Okay, that's really all I needed to achieve from that. So I don't have to finish this aspiration. It's just that this one right here has to be done when she has extremely low skill. And she gains skill so fast that I was afraid she wouldn't be able to do it. Another aspiration that's nice to finish early is the fabulously filthy one. Now, for some reason, it was already dusty here after I got rid of the vacuums. So we maxed out our fun motive on a dusty floor. We won't be able to get the floor dirty for a while though and kitchen bathroom objects are not going to get dirty for a while so we won't be able to make much progress i'm just waiting for school to start now i can also work on my character values because apparently renee has a few bad relationships i can help fix giving gifts also will give us empathy i think oh and it's harvest fest we're not even going to school today Oh, that's right. We are still going to school. So all of the holidays are actually not a day off of work or school. And as usual, we're just going to take Carla. What? Why am I underprepared from forgetting daily task when my homework is complete and I have practice programming complete? That's wrong. I even did my extra credit. Yeah, I checked all of the students and I don't see any rivals. I mean, that's not fair. I want an enemy rival. It takes so long to get upstairs from the basement. So if you're working out, you have to go as soon as the bell rings. You can't finish what you were doing. I have a feeling that the reason why Carla can't get an enemy rival is because she hasn't even been to one club meeting yet. There's only two students in this classroom. And there's six students and the one that I'm in. Maybe it has to do with how many Sims you have on the lot at the same time. Let's see if we can actually go help fix the bad relationship between our enemy and another student. Probably not. No, she did not like that. It got my conflict resolution up though, and I can apologize to her. Okay, I didn't know it, but Carlo was crushing on Kale. So Carla's mind is clear. No longer will she be plagued with thoughts of Kale. Hurry up, Carla. You're so late. Team practice. A guest coach came to practice today to prepare the team for the upcoming competition. This could be a good opportunity to prank them. They won't even see it coming. Um, no, I don't want to get in trouble. I think don't prank will be the least likely to get me performance lost. After thinking up a mischievous plan, Carla realized it would not be nice to prank the guest coach. Better yet, she did not want to get the rest of the tree team in trouble for it. Today will be another day of boring practice. Decreased relationship with teammates? Okay. Yeah, Akshara is still the only computer team member. Well, maybe we'll have her come over and try and repair our relationship. Oh, I have to remember to wash Renee's face and Carla's face because if you have acne as a teen and you age up, you actually keep it as an adult and you can't get rid of it. It's annoying. 
What you can also do is you can take other Sims in your household and say help fix bad relationship and that will actually get a little bit of relationship with the person you're enemies with and it's easier than anything else. And if I can even get one thing to work in the tiny home, then the relationship boost will make this very easy to repair. Okay, singing about Harvest Fest for some reason always succeeds. Nothing else was working. Apologizing, flattering. Okay, we finally settled our differences and we're no longer enemies, but I don't want to be friends. Okay, you can go home, Ekshara. And now Carla is a picky eater. Time to go to school. I don't get it. It looks like Ekshara is also in the chess club and there's a lot of chess club members but I don't see anybody. Oh, maybe you're in the computer? I mean, it doesn't really match my work outfit. Okay, apparently you have to look it up on their individual page. And there's our rival. We have to make enemies with Zach. And of course, this is going to ruin our character values, but oh well. Oh, I know how I can do it without ruining my reputation or my character values. Social Bunny. Oh, I have 76 followers. Finally, I'm getting some followers on Social Bunny. Okay, good. Zach is my friend. I can ruin that. Oh, darn it. Why did I remove him? Message him, not remove him. <laughs> okay, I can finally declare him my enemy. That took a little while, but I'm not above doing something like that so that I don't have to ruin my character values because it's just annoying. And now I'm a drama llama. It still dropped my conflict resolution. We'll try apologizing because that'll actually get me some of it back. Well, we maxed our writing skill. I wonder if we got the connections one, if we would start out higher in a school activity. Because I hate trying to go through these activities. There's so many of them. I was planning on doing the part-time jobs before getting this so that we could actually make progress through them, but now I'm kind of over it. It is just so hard to get performance. So we're just going to buy the connections thing and then let's switch our school activity. Let's just go down the list because cheer team member gets you athletic skill and I didn't want to do that one right now because I didn't want athletic skill before I did the Mount Kumarabi one. So we can get athletic skill now and it won't matter. And we're level one, great. The only way to progress in the school activities is to actually do the stupid performance. Great. Practicing on the chair mat. <laughs> yeah, like someone could do the splits right away like that. Even if you're physically fit, that takes flexibility that most people don't have. Poetry. The end class assignment today was to write some poetry. Easy enough. Poetry is just some words and maybe they are supposed to rhyme. Looking it up on her phone, Carla found some good poetry online as examples, but she is running out of time. Should Carla plagiarize some lesser known poems and take the credit? No, we're going to write an original poem. We have good writing skill. Carla diligently writes out a poem. The teacher looks over her work and nods approvingly. Maybe Carla has a knack for poetry. I don't need the performance boost though. But I didn't want to get detention. All right, so we made a club and we're going to start a gathering and try to get the ability to boost our career performance from being in the club. No, I do not want to graduate. Butterscotch aged up. He's an adult now. Hooray for Butterscotch. Oh, Butterscotch is actually female. This is going to be so quick. We're getting to the top of the research and debate skill because I think you can ask your boss for a promotion after a while, but I can't remember when. Oh, Carla can convince other Sims to go streaking. She can also convince boss to give bonus on the phone. I think that is the one that gets you the performance. But... You can't get a bonus for an after-school activity. Oh, well, that sucks. Well, I guess it only works for careers. 
Okay, we maxed the research and debate skill. Okay, the only other way that I can think of that you can get some kind of bonus performance is to have a bad reputation and bribe your boss for, for performance. That is going to be really hard to do, though, and will screw up all of my conflict resolution and empathy. So I don't think we can do that while we're a teen. Oh, I forgot. There is another way if you're famous. So with the fame points, you can get easy street, easier career advancement, larger paycheck and positive work days. But that means you have to be a global superstar. And I really don't want to do that, but maybe I should. Okay, the quickest way I can think of to get fame is by selling paintings. Oh, she got the admired icon aspiration, so her social bunny fans must have picked up. I didn't notice. Yes, she has 387 followers. I'm glad I kept that one selected. Okay, now I think this one is another one where you kind of have to have it selected sometimes, although it says earn and keep it a two out of three. So I guess it rolls over at midnight, not at the end of the school day, which is annoying. And now we're at max painting skill. Well, that's a means to an end though. Okay, we're just gonna follow Carla and I didn't get to sell my last painting. I was almost a one star celebrity. I'm going to see if I can do some paintings before class because I really don't care about my class performance. Okay, now I'm a notable newcomer and I have three fame points. You're only supposed to have one. Kick me. It's almost like grade school all over again. At some point during class, some of the rougher classmates silently put a kick me sign on the back of a fellow student. Someone should stand up to those bullies, but should it be today? Make a scene about the sign to the teacher and tell the classmate discreetly. Well, if you make a scene to the teacher, then most likely you might get in trouble. I don't know. I guess we'll tell the classmate discreetly. Carla, oh no, passing notes. Carla passed a note to her classmate that they have a sign on their back. The classmate looks upset but grateful to be told. Okay, at least we didn't get caught passing notes. I don't want detention. Okay, that was earning and keeping an A, and that rolled over right at 3 p.m. Team practice. Just before starting practice for the day, the team notices that a rival club member has messed with your gear. This will really set back practice for the day while the team cleans up the mess and makes arrangements for replacements. Carla feels upset about the audacity of the other team to do something like this. She can get payback by doing the same to them or try to talk things through with the rival team in an attempt to make things better. Uh, I think we should just get revenge. This is probably going to backfire, but her mischief is high. Her charisma is high. Uh, I guess get revenge. Together, the team felt united getting revenge, but Carla can't help but feel like maybe the revenge was not the right way. Great. Hopefully that didn't hurt my performance. She's not going to get promoted today, though. Yeah, she's close, but not there. Well, back to practicing. This is going to take forever to get through all of the school activities. You don't even go every day. You only go like three days a week. Hey, Carla, it's Gulliver. Do you want to hang out tonight at a nightclub? No, that doesn't count as sneaking out to a party. We're going to try the digital sketch pad because you can actually queue up some and hope maybe she'll get burnout. That would actually be nice. I don't think she can though because she has so many different things that counteract that. Ah, even with painting, this takes a while. Don't mind me. I'm just going to sit in the back of the classroom until class starts and do some paintings. No, don't come talk to me. Of course, everyone tries to come talk to me whenever I'm busy. Now I'm a rising star. Why are we still crushing on Kale? Uh, I thought we got over him. Let's try again. It's just not working. He's not disappearing. This is bad. Okay, I no longer have the option to try to go get over Crush. So hopefully Kale is not my crush. Okay, so... Kale is crushing on me. I don't have that sentiment towards him. Hopefully it wears off because it looks like it's only halfway there. 
I think you can also practice singing and get tips. Don't really care about tips, but getting fame. Oh, I only finished 75% of my cheering. Well, that sucks. It's probably still enough to get promoted. But just in case, we'll try and finish it, hopefully, before practice starts. Okay, it's done. Dust bunnies. Okay, come on. Get promoted. You're almost there. Going to work twice in order to get promoted is so annoying. When you only go three days a week. Promoted to cheerleading teammate. And the activity is not until four more days. Maybe I should just take tomorrow off and just paint. The only day I really have to go is Tuesday because Tuesday's career day, but that's next week. Well, this takes forever and is pretty boring. Another way that we can do this is we can kind of use Social Bunny in order to make enemies with people, but that also takes a lot of clicking. So I'm not sure I'm up to doing that yet because he, she keeps autonomously getting friends. I'm going to have to turn that off. Oh, being in the tiny home makes this so much easier. Okay, now she's disliked by a few people on Social Bunny. I'm going to stop doing that for now, but maybe that'll help. And the whole point of that is to get her reputation down, because if you get it too atrocious, you can actually bribe your boss for job performance. And yeah, her pristine reputation is going down a little bit. Oh, Wolfie has aged up and passed his peak, or her peak, sorry. Wolfie is a girl, so now she's an elder. Aww. Well, we knew it would happen eventually. The pets are going to age up and pass on, and I am not going to get any more pets for a while. Now, the only thing about ruining my reputation is I won't be able to do the giving back, gain reputation even faster, donate objects to fans for fame. And that is like the fastest way to do it because I can't take the bad route for that. Well, it says gain fame from mischief interactions. Mischief is fine. I just can't do mean interactions. Let's just call in sick to school. Yeah, we don't have activity today. So even if it were to let me skip the activity because I was sick, uh, it wouldn't matter because today we don't go. And nothing special. We're going to spend all day painting. This might become an issue, though, because there is a milestone that it says experience burnout. However, Carla is never going to get burnt out, I don't think. She has this idea person. These Sims focused on a combination of mental and creativity skills during their childhood. Due to their efforts, they can now paint, write, program, and write songs faster. Any writer's block will also vanish more quickly. Well, it, it just said just sounds like she's not going to get right I mean because I've been painting writer's block is not the same thing as burnout but I've been painting for so long and she hasn't even begun to get burnout unless you only get burned out as an adult okay she's finally a b-lister I can fast track it now by donating computers to fans the only problem is donating the computers also gets me positive reputation okay so that one cannot be three stars Okay, the immersive bend, which is 3,000. I guess the closest you can get it to 3,000 is the best, where you get three stars and it's the cheapest item. I think the art TV is actually better because I can put it on a wall and it doesn't require a desk or a table. And now I'm a proper celebrity. Yeah, just cover the walls with TVs and then donate them all. And now I'm a five-star celebrity. It's funny how the good route is the easiest route because you can basically buy your celebrityhood. Now, unfortunately, my reputation is almost max again. Okay, every time I get someone to dislike me through Social Bunny, it takes a little bit off my reputation, but not very much. It's kind of annoying to do that. I may wait until next week to do that. Oh, poor Wolfie is sick. We'll have to go to the vet and get her some treats. Oh no, turn that off. I hate the star walk. Use normal walk style. 
Here you go, Wolfie. This will make you feel better. And you only have to give these treats once a week. It'll prevent your pet from getting sick, too. And we'll give her a bath, too, because I think she's dirty. No. Why does this say on vacation? Please tell me it's not going to let me take Monday off for my activity. I did not want that. Uh, is it because I called in sick to school on a Friday? I'm not really sure what to do with Carla right now. So she's a global superstar and she just needs to reach level three of her cheerleading activity and attend career day. Oh, and sneak out to a party which she hasn't been invited to yet. I don't know, maybe you have to have that active in order to get invites? Oh, and if she makes enemies with everyone, she probably won't get invited. Oh, crud. I'm not going to be able to do that enemy route. I'm just going to have to do the good route, which is not really what I want to do. Now, it's the cow competition this weekend for the Finchwick Fair, but we're going to go to prom at least one more time. Okay, make that two more times. Apparently, you have to get bronze at prom and silver at prom. Oh, so annoying. If you get the gold one, you should be able to buy the bronze and silver ones without having to do, actually do another prom. But I guess we have to do at least three proms. We only have to do two with Renee, though. Yeah, unfortunately, this is what a blue face looks like when it's covered in zits. Uh, sorry, Renee, I keep forgetting to put the facial cleanser on you. I think these horses eat this hay and the prairie grass really, really fast. There's four horses, but it seems like I'm filling it up almost every single day, which I guess it makes sense because there's eight servings, but then there's also prairie grass. Maybe if I make a wish for job performance... Oh, there's just better grades, youthful vigor, skills, simoleons, romance, and happiness. Can't wish for job performance as a teen. It seems like nothing can boost your performance in these stupid after-school activities, which kind of sucks. There we go, we mastered dancing. What other skill doesn't have anything to do with pretty much any aspiration? Bowling! <laughs> Where can we fit a bowling alley? Not here. Yeah, because the bowling lane outside makes a lot of sense. <laughs> You're really bad at it, Carla. I should have bowled something shorter, though. I picked a 10-frame game, and I don't think that she's going to need it. She's already level 3. Level 4. And level 5, which is max. Okay, you can stop doing that now, maybe? I don't know if you can cancel it or not. Oh, I can. Good. I think photography is another one of those skills, but photography kind of sucks because all you can do is take pictures and it doesn't take a lot of time. Oh, and I don't want her to use her phone that much because I don't want that quirk. I wish I could get the quirk where she likes good food, but I keep eating good food and she's not getting the quirk. Taking photos will actually get you that phone quirk. Okay, finally, she got the refined palette quirk. All right, I need to figure out three more quirks that she can get that I actually don't mind. I guess the fan mail one isn't so bad, but we need to interact with a lot of fans for that. Hey Carla, we're having a little get together before prom. Want to join? Of course I do. Let's just make sure we take Renee with us. And of course it had to be this place. Yeah, this is a little tiny home I built. It's, uh, it's okay, but not the ideal place for a party okay this party is lame everyone even left okay prom is starting let's make sure we get a photo at least this time all right we'll get silver this time what did i forget to vote for jester i think i did well i guess we have to go to one more prom okay we got our silver medal well, that's the end of another week, and we're still trying to get people to bring our reputation down. I don't know if we'll be able to bribe our boss for a promotion, but we're only a good reputation instead of pristine. 
So this is Charity. Thanks for watching.